Damn, hold on. Hello? Hey y'all, baby, these pot, these tacos is on fire. I haven't had them in so long. Y'all don't laugh at me. I had four. Forget to like, share, and subscribe. <clears throat> it's me. Natural, baby. This is your girl talking with Shani, and I am back with another video, which y'all see I don't have no more. But anywho, anyhow, it has been real nice. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification button so every time your girl go live, you'll know it. Oh. I had a craving for some taco, and I did it, but, <clears throat> and here, anyhow, mm, 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 mm. <laughs> y'all, I look like this because today, 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 baby, <laughs> I um I cut my grass <clears throat> because I was like, you know what, tomorrow's Saturday. I don't want to do nothing else. I just want to sit and chill, so let me do my chores. So I cut the grass. I did about, it takes me about three hours to cut my grass, to weed whack, blow the grass. Y'all, I'm very deep, so one day I'm going to take y'all on the tour. I'm going to vlog me cutting the grass. But anywho, anyhow, y'all, I got my window open, y'all. It rained up here. Yes, we needed that rain, y'all. And some, I, I promise you, I start to cut my grass on a three, but your girl cut it at a five really high, so it's going to grow back really, really, really fast, super fast. Really, I should have really cut it at a three. But anywho, anyhow, how y'all doing? How y'all doing? I hope y'all is doing all as well. I do have a word of encouragement on today as I walk out. For those who don't know, I am from the 414 area, Bucks and Six. <laughs> I got to get that out every time just in case we got some Phoenix Suns, <laughs> Phoenix fans, <laughs> fly back. Anyway, and um, congratulations to the Bucks. Yes, they did their thing. They really wanted that. But um, shout out to Miss Beloved. 
Um, for the, all those, we already seen the situation. Um, um, we heard about our, our brother Dalvin. So all those, when you do get a chance and you hear this, please call out Dalvin name. I've been praying for him. Miss Beloved, if you see this, which I doubt you do, but we love you. Stay encouraged. Be encouraged. Stay encouraged. Know that God will never put no more on you sincerely from me. God will never put no more on you than you can bear. God allows certain things to happen. Amen. To continue warning us to keep the faith in him. Um, God got Delvin. I mean, no matter what the doctor said, I'm just saying keep the faith. No matter what they say, no matter what his condition goes up and down. The Bible says now faith is the substance of things hoped for, evidence of things not seen. For we walk by faith and not by sight. So y'all don't forget to pray for Dalvin. Don't forget to pray for Miss Sandy. Don't forget to pray for Chilling with Walk. Um, and y'all know I gotta pray because Dalvin Daddy Chunk Chunk is one of my favorite YouTubers. I love Daddy Chunk Chunk. His personality is out of sight and down a mic. And the devil in hell is a lie. And I am a prayer warrior and I have been praying, really truly have been praying for that young man. Um, for speedy recovery and for God to give him the patience, amen, you know, until he gets out. And we believe in God to be the heir to those lungs, be the oxygen that he needs, open up the airwaves so that he can breathe, remove the fluid. Whatever this virus is, we plead the blood against any bacteria in the name of Jesus and we thank God that all power, that body, that mind belongs to God. Those lungs belongs to God. So, Miss Beloved, if you see this, I love you. I wasn't even going that way. And then I was going to talk about something else. But again, y'all, when you see your brethren fall, if you see your brethren is in need or you see something that is different than the norm that you not used to them doing. Amen. Pray. As I was walking today, y'all. And um, what you see is what you get. I don't have no makeup on. And it's purpose. Um, OMG is what my shirt, shirt says. But I don't have no makeup on. Because I want you to see me as I am. And so when I was walking today. The Lord always gave me a message. And I didn't know really what I was going to talk about. So as I began to walk. My message on today was. It's me, but pray for me. And then so um, a part of it was saying that when you see me, pray for me. If you see me acting unseemly, pray for me. If you see me looking like a way that I usually don't look, pray for me. If you see me acting out of characteristics or unusual behavior, pray for me. If you see me looking sad, pray for me. If you see me smiling, pray for me. When you see me, it's me. But pray for me because so many times we as people like to judge people. And this came about when somebody said they saw me and I didn't look right. Instant pray for me. If I don't look the way you want me to look, pray for me. But when you see me, I'm going to be me. It's me. And so if we pray in season and out of season like the old saint says, <coughs> Baby, there's no room for the enemy to get what in. And so I just thank and praise God. And so if that be you out there that I'm talking to and encouraging on today, let's encourage and uplift one another because that is a mother's cry, a mother's love. I'm telling you, a mother's job will never be fulfilled. And I know that's a hurting feeling, Miss Beloved, but know that Milwaukee, Wisconsin is praying for you all. There's prayer warriors all over the world praying for him. And, um, but the Bible, I want to give encouraging scriptures, amen, to those who have lost loved ones, <clears throat> amen, or, or have a loved one that is sick and afflicted. We just need to stand in the gap. That's what, because we do them better by standing in the gap, by being their hope, amen, because they're the one going through. So we do better by giving them hope for tomorrow. We have to stand in the gap, but we, a lot of us, we need strength the bible so let the strong bear the infirmities of the weak so that's all i'm saying on today love y'all god bless y'all if you see somebody again praise god that's looking a certain way ain't looking the same and you like what i don't have no makeup on but pray for me 
Hey man, I don't need makeup on because that's what happened. I got eyebrows. I was just telling somebody I got eyebrows. But baby, I, I'm so used to drawing them on and filling them in. It took away my natural. It looked like it clogged up my natural. But anywho, anyhow, I'm, I'm me. It's just me. Amen. So I just pray and hope that we can continue. Let's try that and do that here. Let's uplift and encourage one another. Amen. We help us to one another. Again, Miss Beloved, Milwaukee, Wisconsin is praying for Brother Dalvin. Dalvin, whenever you see this, baby, Milwaukee is praying. Nicole, of course, we're praying for you. Uh, Darius, we're praying for you. We're praying for the whole family. All right, I love y'all. God bless y'all until we meet again. Don't forget to pray for somebody. Uplift, strengthen, and motivate, and always give hope for tomorrow. Remember, Miss Beloved, the scripture, Psalms 23. That's our scripture for today, Psalms 23. And I'm constant reminder of, yea, though I walk through the valleys of the shadow of death, I fear no evil. So we're going to go and face some death situation beyond death, but know that fear no evil. All right. Peace.